Hi, it's me Lillian here, helping you women to feel well, live better, with less stress, more calm and rest. And just look at this gorgeous place. It's a really, really nice place to, to just come and rest basically, and to breathe and to, um, and to have less stress. <laughs> Um, so today's video is soul care or self care. We've heard in the wellness space, you know, a lot about self care. Some people imagine it to be going for pampering sessions, having massages, um, having long baths, doing your nails, doing your hair is all part of self care, and, and it has its place. It is, but for me, self care goes a lot more deeper, and. I'm tending to look more at soul care because we live in a fast-paced society a lot of women and I say a lot of women because this is what I come across in my daily life and in my work a lot of women are feeling burnt out feeling frazzled and frenzied and stressed and then when they're told to do self-care it's like a plaster effect so it's a case of, right, I've got to book it into my diary, book it into my schedule to do some self-care. And then they go back into their fast-paced living lifestyle, which creates the stress in the first place, the frenzy, the, the irritation, the frustrations, etc. So I'm tending to look more at soul care, where we actually look and analyse and uncover what is going on with you at a soul root level? So for me, the soul is your will, your mind and your emotions. Because from there, that's what creates whatever is going on within the body. So it's okay for us to do the self-care techniques like I've mentioned previously. But they only last for a short term. I don't know whether you find that. And that's something that I found, you know, doing your self-care um, remedies or solutions will only last a short term but if you look to the soul care really taking time out to care for your soul which you do as you go along in daily life it's a process it's not a quick fix solution or a quick fix remedy um, but a soul care you're looking at your will are you aligned to your values are you aligned to your desires are you aligned to your your natural strengths are you aligned to your gifts are you aligned to your purpose and are you being fulfilled in these and are you fulfilling these things every day then we look to the emotions where are you in terms of your emotional health your emotional well-being are you tending to be more in what we call the lower scale of the emotions so anger frustration are you unhappy do you feel really um, compressed and constricted do you feel stressed <laughs> Um, and you know how are you going to make the process towards what we call the the higher vibrational emotions the elevated emotions of calm of peace of joy of love then we look at so that's your will that's your emotions then we look at the mind what state is your mind currently in so what is the level of your mental wellness what is the level of your mental health what is the level of your mental well-being so these are the elements that I tend to look at when it comes to soul care. And like I say, it's, it's a process. It's something that is done every day. It's not a quick fix thing. It's not a, as what is being deemed in the, what I find is being deemed in the wellness space as a quick fix for self care. And oh, we feel better now. Now I can go back into my fast paced routine. No, soul care is deeper. It's, it takes care of you at a root level. So, let me know what you take away from this video and have you heard of soul care? Everyone, I think most of us have heard of self care but have you heard of soul care? And if you haven't, will you start to implement some of the areas that I've mentioned? Looking at your will, the, the position of your will, the health of your will, the well-being of your will. Will you start to look at the wellness of your mind? And looking at the wellness and the well-being of your emotions. It's all part of us and it's very important when it comes to us living better, feeling well, with less stress, more calm and more rest as well. So let me know what you take away from this video. Any questions you've got, pop them in the comments or you can 
um, send me a personal message if you want to have a chat as well about areas that you know need more work on in terms of helping you to live with less stress and more calm and rest then again send me a personal message and let's book a time to have a chat speak to you in the next video